the year is just about over and I just figured why not go out and cop a pair you know new sneakers and just represent one of the illest players of all time actually one of the best ball handlers that we ever seen Kyrie Irving now a lot of people like the Kyrie fives I did you know I had an argument just about uh, the Kyrie 4 and the Kyrie 5 with a lot of people and basically I really didn't see too much of a difference I mean you'll see one side do this unboxing but you can do the research on YouTube these joints or not too much of a difference, but I'm more of a Kyrie 4 type guy, and it's for personal reasons, but let's unbox these joints, and we'll go from there. Nothing like an unboxing, so we start by cutting it open. Here are the Kyrie 4. You can see from the box. Kyrie has this name all on it. Also, the Nike logo, the 4. And this is a size 10 and a half. And these are the Dark Ocidia in black. I tend to have these are retailed at 120, but you could find them probably online for a little bit cheaper since they have five dollars. So let's open these bad boys up. Look inside. Boom. Fresh to death. That colorway is what I love. See, I love different varieties of blue. To be honest with you, so I I never go wrong with blue or red. It, it, it wouldn't matter to me what type of uh, blue they were, but <laughs> I love blue. So let's talk a little bit about this shoe. So the Nike Kyrie 4, which is uh, Kyrie's fourth, fourth shoe. Now, uh, this is the Dark Ossibian. Uh, they came out this year, actually, at the beginning of the year. So, it's made a premium suede, like all of this. If anybody got a pair, anybody who want a pair, yes, these are suede. So, you know it's easy to mess up suede, so you would need some suede protection for these. And knitted materials across the upper. If you see that Nike swoosh in there, that's knitted, stitched. And it's basically, I mean, the design, my God, is so similar to the Kyrie 5. It's ridiculous. And it has that navy hue, basically covers the design and then broided swooshes on the, on the side. So you see that on both sides there. Um, it has a mixture of blue and neon green and that's pretty much highlighted uh, accents they're applied on the tongue branding as you can see right there the Kyrie logo the insoles Let's look inside of them in there Also, both shoes. There's a Kyrie signature up inside the insole. Kind of deep in there, but yeah. You can see that. It's neon looking. And a white midsole completes the design altogether. I still, these are brand, brand new. You, you still got. <laughs> 
your paper in there. This is when you buy brand new shoes. Me, sometimes I even keep this in there just because I, I love to smell them. <laughs> and they smell brand new. So, yeah. Kyrie has his, you get a little autograph from Kyrie on the insole up in there, which is cool. I mean, Kyrie's a dope player. And the white midsole, like I was saying, completes the design. Back to what I was saying about how similar these are to the fives. The real difference is a, a little bit in the technology. Uh, these actually, the bottom, as you can see, has the zigzags. Also it has the number 11. Uh, and right here it says fear is not real. <laughs> Kyrie always has some, some quotes that uh, people question. Uh, inside he has that weird tattoo on his hand. And I, I went deep into that, man. That looks Illuminati. And, uh, <laughs> you know, I'm not really into that shit. You know, I hope he ain't selling his soul to the devil. I believe in Jesus. But I think he's a, a good player. But, uh, you know, I think this shoe... Man, the suede on here, that, that really kind of got me because the suede is so good on these shoes. Um, it's just, you really can't compare a lot of shoes to uh, the way that Kyrie comes up with, you know, the, the weird shit he puts on his shoes. For instance, if you look at the colorway with the neon and the, <clears throat> the, the blue neon, in the green, people, people would think that's like a mark that's, uh, you got dirt or something on there. But then when you open them and look at them brand new, you can see them shits is just like, you know, some dope spray paint or graffiti type stuff. But I'm still stuck on suede, like the suede feel, man. This is what a big selling point. You don't want nobody to, I mean, if you're not going to even hoop in these, you don't want no one to even step on them because that suede. So it has that. The air unit, same basic uh, air unit from, I think, the uh, the three, because all the Kyrie shoes look alike, but they're hella comfy, and they're made and designed for you to play ball in. So, but I think the only difference really in the five is that you got that, uh, it's like a new lacing, not really new, they had a strap when you lace them up, but pretty much, man, I was like, these... Because of the shark fans, this was so on the side that design. I think that design with the shark fan just is way better than the design of the five. If you be your own judge, uh, I'm about to do an on feet for you guys, but I give these right here, man, just because of the design of the four. I think the four is his best. Some might argue with that. A five out of five because the colorway of these, uh, and also you can't go wrong with that that blue i like the color like i said the blue and the black like this video leave your comments and stay tuned for the on feet subscribe